Hey, my name is Forrest Dukes, and I'm the CEO of BlueSense. So you guys have seen some pretty good pitches so far, like Social Toast, and you're watching some awesome ones, like BlueSense. And I'm sure you're probably wondering, okay, so afterwards, how am I gonna actually find him outside when there are like 600 other people trying to find him? Well, what if there was an app where you could actually pull it up and see where I was in real time in other uh, startup companies, and then go find me? That's what BlueSense is trying to do. So Charles Eames, which is an American uh, architect and designer, once said that everything eventually connects. People, ideas, and objects. The quality of the connections is key to quality, per se. I know, when I first read that too, I was like, what? But I thought it was really an, a really interesting quote, and it really shows an important part that you know, connections and meaningful connections are really important in life. So you know, the question is, how do you create meaningful connections? Well, we think that uh, LinkedIn actually has a pretty decent solution to this. So they have networking where you can get on, of course, see uh, you know, your professional sphere, uh, basically, and you can also see connections of connections. And then you can see the information. Um, you can see where they work, their skill set, different interests, and of course, they have communications. So you can message them and actually connect. But we think that they're missing one very key part to this, and that's real life. So like I was mentioning earlier, while you can actually find these people behind a desktop or while you're sitting down buried in your phone, when it comes to actually being in a real-time environment like this conference, I mean, this is a networking event, you won't actually be able to go and you know, track them down with your phone. So that's what we're trying to solve, basically. So we have a three-part solution. Um, we're gonna use LinkedIn's user profile information and just import it into our app. We're gonna use a positioning, so each person that actually has our app downloaded will be on this, um, you know, on our BlueSense network, and you'll be able to actually see them in real time. And we're gonna have an event management side, which is basically a backend that provides a lot of services for the event host. So we take all three of these uh, ideas, you put them into an app, and you have a real-time solution you can apply to job fairs, networking events, uh, conferences, happy hours, whatever you can imagine, where there are people who wanna actually connect and they have this app downloaded, you'll be able to connect. And that is the secret to meaningful connections. So, yes, that's a good takeaway from this, I guess. Um, and now here's a uh, crudely drawn mock-up of what the app's actually gonna look like. It doesn't really compare to what you've seen tonight, but it gets the point across. So you see in the middle, you have uh, basically your own profile, and then around, you can filter out different people using the layers icon in the bottom right-hand corner, and then you'll be able to actually see them in real time around you. So if I was standing in a room and I had, you know, um, some friends that are also in the startup class with me. I'd be able to see them and also click on their icons, bring up profiles, uh, see where they, basically see all their LinkedIn information, and then I could actually you know, go up and talk to them um, and make a meaningful connection. So that's basically where BlueSense is trying to go with this, and that's what our basic app idea is. Now the market for conferences, uh, last year, 294, or sorry, in 2011, $294 billion were spent, 58% just from the production side, and there are 205 million conference attendees every year in the U.S. alone. I mean, that's an astronomical amount of people that are, of course, going and networking and connecting. So clearly this is something that's very important. People are willing to spend money on this, and we have a good solution that will help them actually create more connections. So our plan for monetization of this is pretty simple. We're gonna have two different sides, one being the event management side. You wanna provide a one-stop shop so you can actually go on, this event, uh, go on this event app and register. And then we're also gonna have itinerary and events so you'll be able to see in real time, you know, um, any updates to rooms or where people are presenting. And then of course, we really are excited to provide event analytics to the actual conference hosts. So you'll be able to get, um, have surveys basically where you, you know, give feedback how the conference was, you'll be able to see how many people at your conference actually connected to other people, all kinds of very meaningful uh, statistics to the conference planners. And then we haven't fleshed it out as much, but the user experience side as well, we plan to charge for extra layers, basically different search filters, and we're gonna have notifications so you can actually send out um, information and messages to all the conference attendees while they're at the events. And so that's basically the uh, entire idea behind BlueSense, but we also have a couple of other areas we want to explore. And so these are other applications that we have brewing under uh, the lid. Of course, since we're making an app, you can also port it to things like Google Glass and smartwatches, which is really exciting, uh, just different mediums where you can have this app running on. And we also have different um, events like dating, which is something really interesting, I think, appliance to speed dating, where you can actually find different people who you might match up with. It's just an idea. Um, these are all, again, just things that we want to pursue in the far future after we've implemented the conference and events uh, medium. 
So this is our team. Again, I'm Forrest Dukes. I'm the CEO of BlueSense. This is Kevin Lamb in the middle. He is the chief technical officer. Jonathan No is our hardware engineer. And then finally, Joshua Rosales is our chief research officer. If you have any questions about BlueSense, please come find one of us after the pitches are over. Thank you.